Hello there, this is the Bookkeeping Master on YouTube. Thank you for taking the time to view this video. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate a very simple eBay account template or eBay account spreadsheet. At the end of the video, I will provide a link so you, so you can create this spreadsheet yourself. The spreadsheet is split into three sections. This is the first section where we have our assets and liabilities listed. I have a capital account, a bank checking or current account, a savings account, a couple of credit cards, a PayPal account, an Amazon account, a cash account, an inventory or stock account, and then a few accounts spare. For assets or liabilities we may add in the future. In this section, we would record funds transferred from one account to another and also any sales information. Our second section is here, expenditure part one. In this section, we would enter the date and details of an expense and allocate the funds to the asset or liabilities the funds came out of or the account which incurred the expense. So say we had £100 come out of our Barclays checking account, we would put 100 under Barclays checking account. Our third section is expenditure part two, and this is where we allocate our, our funds from our previous section to the expense code. So the example I gave was £100 out of our Barclays current account, we could just put 100 under car rental if the expense was for car rental. Transactions are simply entered into each section. We then have a second tab down the bottom, which is an automated profit and loss statement and an automated balance sheet. With the profit and loss statement, everything is automated apart from the sales information. You'll need to enter that manually, but apart from that, the gross profit is calculated, net profit, and all of your expenditure for the period and then the balance sheet is fully automated and you won't need to do anything to the balance sheet. So this is the spreadsheet. I've seen a number of templates and spreadsheets that will calculate fees for you and be quite flashy from the financial side of the business or the account side of the business. But we don't need that as part of a bookkeeping spreadsheet. For example, with eBay, we'll be using PayPal and PayPal provide reports that will give you your sales and fee information per month. We would take that information from PayPal reports and just enter that onto this spreadsheet. Our provider link it should appear on the right. Click on that and you can create this bookkeeping spreadsheet yourself. Alternatively, drop me an email and I can email you this template for a small fee if you provide your asset liability account name also the expense codes in the email then I can enter them for you so the spreadsheet is ready to go as soon as you receive it or I will also provide a number of spare accounts for expenses and asset and liabilities just in case anything crops up in the future and you need to add some more so drop me an email at info at bpfs, that's bravo, papa, foxtrot, sierra, hyphen, online.com or go to our website www.bpfs, bravo, papa, foxtrot, sierra, hyphen, online.com Thank you so much for watching.